every year in our community, we have about 200 refugees that come to the United States and relocate in Kentucky. And these are people that um, have experienced persecution, maybe um, political, um, physical, um, social persecution in their country, and they come for a new start in the United States. Uh, and about 1,200 of them actually will stay in Louisville uh, initially. So this is an opportunity to work with um, Catholic Charities and the Kentucky Office of Refugees to provide the vaccines that they need so they can work toward green card and then citizenship. So this is a chance for us to uh, not only experience and learn from other cultures, but it gives us the opportunity to do what we do best. You can study the books all the time and every night, and we have to, but um, of course when you get out there is whenever you learn the most. You learn the most about yourself, about the people that you're caring for, and how to care for them properly. You can't read that in a textbook. By having students as part of the process, not only are they learning some of the basics about what are these vaccines, what are they for, how do I administer them, how do I handle them so they're handled correctly, but they're working with people who don't speak this, the same language, who have very different, in, in some respects, very different cultural backgrounds. How do we relate to people? How do we deal with different value systems, different languages, different cultural systems? And how do we find many of the common grounds that are necessary for people when they come into a community and then when they look for health services? When you actually see them and you get to interact with them, it does make you stop and think, you know, these people came from nothing, gave up a lot, left families behind, and, and we're here to help them, and it, it feels really good to be able to help them.